it's your girl Mayabum, if you girl me, I'm sick of summer, so many the astrology. I got this little homey, homey look going on because I talk about cancer woman. <laughs> cancer is all about the home, the wife, the mommy, everything we love. I love cancer women. If you have not already, Go check out some of my music and check out this music video that I just dropped for my song Dangerous off my EP Siren. You're dangerous, say you couldn't hang with us. Pull a hand up in the air, sway you never changing us. Smoking angel us, something always changing up. One by one, you let it go, you switching up, can't hang with us. Go check it out. I've been such in a good mood lately. I've been healing my faith and moving like okay but basically yeah so cancer women i i adore cancer women real bad and most definitely i feel like people really need to understand cancer women like there's just they're extremely cautious when you meet them at first don't look at them as the angry shellfish the grumpy sh they're very cautious at first because they want to know who they're dealing with okay mind you this is the mother okay this is the opposite polarity of um, capricorn okay and man I, I i really have a soft spot for cancer women because like man i just first of all they they're some go-getters like you know like how the mom is in the house regardless if the man is home or not she's still gotta make some work the house gotta operate because mommy gotta cook mommy gotta clean mommy gotta be a nurse i'm gonna do this and this and that it's just like when they apply that into like the workforce they're the strongest people to work with seriously so famous can um, cancer women that are like now, you know, getting some buzz. Um, Margot Robbie, she's the lady that plays Barbie. Nina Gomez, Lil Kim, Madison Pettis. Who else? I think Jessica Simpson is a cancer. I don't know. Don't quote me on that. But like cancer women, something about them that just really glows. I already mentioned some in the part one. You can go check that out. But like with cancer women, okay, you get to touch femininity ass like mother and child like but like i said when you first meet cancers they're extremely guarded and they can come off as a bitch because they're very sensitive because you know they're intuitive by nature that's just who they are they like very aware of their surroundings and who they are like you know aside from everything outside of what they know they're very cautious and guarded remind me of flowers ultimately because flowers and plant or oh, just plants and virgos remind me of plants but specifically flowers with cancers because like they represent what they bloom into and after like it's been constructed in its roots in gemini and just blossoms in cancer so like i have these roses here and i have two examples so, like with roses right or just flowers in general they're just like a direct um what you might call it communicator to a degree i get up and i kiss my roses every way and i mind your distance but like plants overall absorb energy and like cancers can feel energy okay so you know they've done experiments with plants where you speak positive to the plant it grows and grows and grows whereas the negative energies around the plant it dies and i have a dead rose here though just because i have been feeling a little low just to show you oh there you go what it is you know be careful of my cancer because they really mean well okay you're another sign where it's like they get a bad rep for being just emotionally out of, and they can be because cancers will the one thing about you they're like that mom they're like a oh, mom they don't they will never give up on you like they will never like i used to see cancer women get dogged out like when a cancer woman's not in her villain era because when they get into that villain era she's a cheat she's a dog she's a she don't give a fuck because sometimes y'all deserve to be holding out by these people because they're so nice there's like when you really once they you get past that hard shell of the shellfish they're so nice and sweet and just so compassionate but like like i said they're like i said they're like the mom they love you through all the storms and obstacles they just want to make sure you know it's, it's like an unconditional love with cancer seriously so when you really betray them it's kind of justifiable what they do to you now with miss nikki baby oh, she just had a baby with her boyfriend Leangelo, I think me and I do got the same birthday, November 24th. Leangelo, I believe his name, one of the Ball Brothers, congratulations to her. She's a cancer woman, and I just feel like, oh, she's, she's so sweet. And it's like, 
she gets her sweetness her sexiness and she apply like i like i said like pisces and cancers are some of the women that every woman should like take note of because like she's a boss and she's oh she's like wifey type she's a mother and this is that she just manages to make it look effortlessly and that's the one thing about cancers they balance out so much occupations and like skills and make it look effortlessly and that's what like in gemini it's chaotic where it's cancer it's controlled you know they they're very good and it's like they're oh man i i, I do like speaking highly about cancers because i i i love cancers for bad emotional yes jealous yes but they mean well one thing though with cancers is though like i will say just this is just the sag in me you can't be getting too attached to dudes and putting them on a pedestal real quick because y'all like a little water sign scorpio pisces and cancer y'all just want to be one like water like flowing with your partner but in, in today's climate it's not so monogamous it's just so like everybody's just rolling the dice until they find out what they want and continue just rolling the punch i know you may like one dude but it's like that dude can't become your life his problems can't become your problem like guys just like i'm sorry today like guys stay in our climate are so coward to communicate it's just not worth it like like you guys tie your whole identity to dudes and stuff like that that can cause problems in your friendships fuck it forget about it sometimes if a dude is not doing what he's supposed to do you're not his mom fuck him he gotta go sorry for my language but he gotta go he just gotta keep that shit pushing it's just not worth it but with cancer women it's like oh it's just cancer woman love man business in my in my in my man business they love boys they're boy they're the boy crazy type yes they are they love boys they love to put them on a pedestal and you can't do that because like you treat them like a celebrity they're gonna treat you like a fan no yeah. it's just a no but yeah aside from that you know i don't really have anything negative to say i did i did have a more honest approach in part one but this completes part two cancer woman y'all know i love y'all y'all know i love me some y'all okay y'all look good anyways me team my man was one day once rose won't be keeping my channel going check out my music video for my song dangerous and check out all these other zodiac talk videos if you haven't already but i gotta go love you bye <laughs> ah. <laughs> Where's the way to dress me